good morning. So you join me this morning, a cold winter's morning. It snowed yesterday and I have today off, which means only one thing. We're doing Kinder Scout today in the snow. We've parked in Edale, we're going to walk along the Pennine Way. The destination in mind is Kinder Love Tree Point. So uh, depending on light and, and conditions we may go a bit further, but we're going to be sensible. So uh, yeah, I hope you're going to enjoy this as much as I am. The scenery on the way over was absolutely stunning, so uh, I'm very excited to uh, see what it's like when we get up there. Yeah, it's a bit treacherous underfoot at the moment, so uh, I'm going to catch up with you. We get to uh, we get to Jacob's ladder. So I'll see you there. Ha, and as if by magic, here we are at the bottom of Jacob's ladder. So you've not missed a huge deal so far. Uh, footpath that we're walking on. I uh, don't know if you can see down there, but it's it's been quite well trod. So all the snow has been compacted very well uh, which makes for difficult walking conditions to be honest it's uh, well it's slippy underfoot but at the same time it's uneven so uh, it's making for very different walking than normal so yeah good climb ahead of me now that should get me nice and warm and uh, we'll see what the views are like from the top that should be a treat shouldn't it Jacob's Ladder a few times but this was definitely the uh, the diciest climb that I've had up here uh, very deep snow up to the knees in places um, if you want to go slightly off the path and you need to go slightly off the path today because enough people like me are crazy enough to have been up here uh, to have trod it down nicely to uh, sheet ice I'm not looking forward to going back down there, but what goes up must come down, so uh, I guess I'll just have to be very, very careful on the way. Uh, very thankful I bought the poles today. Extra little bit of grip certainly does no harm in a day like this, and uh, also does no harm jamming it into the ground to see how deep the snow is before you put your foot in and fall over. But uh, I'm, I'm not at the top by any stretch. See behind me, there's still a fair way to go, but uh, oh, it's stunning up here, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. Oh, to that. So, this part of the Pennine Way that I'm walking on now used to be a pack horse route hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of years ago uh, where traders would travel from the east to the west and west to the east of the country. So connecting Liverpool and Manchester, the surrounding area to the rest of the country. Now it's tough enough in the best of conditions and I've got the right gear. But I can't imagine how difficult it must have been all that time ago on a bad day, especially when it's snowing, and it snows quite a lot up here. <sighs> really hope it was worth it for everyone who made this trip, because... Imagine not being prepared properly. 
being up here. So when I left the car this morning in the car park it said minus three. That was down in the bottom of the valley as well and I don't know how believable a car thermometer is but still it's a damn sight colder up here than it was down there. Still, I wasn't at Woods. Just listen to that. Absolutely still up here now. That's where we're going. tell you. It doesn't count unless you touch it. So here we are. This is the turning around point of today's walk. Six hundred and thirty-six meters above sea level. It's taken me like to take in the views, the sensible thing to do, start making my way back down as soon as I can, before it starts doing anything to me it shouldn't. So I'll catch you guys later. So not far away from the trick point, Reedale Rocks, I'd originally planned on sheltering in here. Uh, having a spot of lunch. But I don't know if you can see on the video, but a very light flurry of snow has started. And I don't fancy being caught up here if it really turns to something stronger, so uh, I'm making my way down towards Jacob's Ladder again and uh, see if I can find somewhere later on that I can stop for a bite. Sometimes even the best plans need to get changed, don't they? But it's much better to be safe than sorry. So, I had originally planned on going down the old pack horse route uh, the alternative route down Jacob's Bladder, uh, just to see some different views of the valley as I went down. But, um, well, something tells me that that would be a bad idea if I'm looking for any form of views. So uh, I'll go back down the way I came, that's the way I know, and uh, hopefully I can take it nice and slow and steady. I'm now off Kinder Scout, making my way back along the Pennow Way towards Edale. It's still snowing, oh, it just seems to have lightened up a little bit. I remember how it was on the tops. So, again, dicey underfoot on Jacob's Ladder today, which is expected, I suppose. But I must say, I didn't anticipate. The, the amount of people that were at the top that I came across. I thought I'd be the only one who was mad enough to make it out today. But uh, I suppose this is what separates the men from the boys, so to speak. Oh. So yeah, I'm gonna take it steady again on my way 
back towards Edale. It was a little bit tricky underfoot last time, so it's probably going to be exactly the same this time. It's done uh, nothing but get colder since I uh, since I came here earlier. So I'll catch up with you guys. Uh, well, catch up with you in Edale. Just like that, we're almost at the end of the Pennine Way. So I hope you've enjoyed the walk. I have, it's certainly been a challenge. The thing about Kinder Scout, it always throws something different at you. The conditions are always so variable. It's always a, a difficult climb as well, up and down. But it's why I enjoy it so much. So I'm, I'll be honest, I don't know how far the walk has been. I forgot to look ahead of time, the distance between the start and, and midpoint because I've done that segment a fair few times and didn't even think and I haven't had my tracking apps on either so I apologize for that oh, but I'm uh, I'm on my way now to find somewhere warm to have those sandwiches I promised myself at the top so I hope you've enjoyed the video if you have and I assume you have if you watched it this far please uh, subscribe and, and like the video as well I would appreciate it but until next time guys happy walking